welcome to Select Arcane. I finally got my briars back from my parents' house, and it's really nice to see them again. My champion briar halter mare Delilah, aka Mirabella, is one of my favorites in my collection. But I guess while she was away, somebody knocked her over and she rubbed her ear. She used to be a pristine model, and it's a shame. But no worries, that's no problem at all. I can fix that. Firstly, she's really dusty, so let's give her a bath. The bath is not required for the actual repair, she's just really gross. Make sure you plug the hole in any of your briar that you're washing, otherwise water is going to seep in and it's going to be impossible to get out. All briars have the hole and they're usually at the corner of the mouth. I leave her a dry on a dish towel and when she's dry, we can get started. So let's survey the damage now that she's clean and dry. It appears that the ear is the only issue on her. Her hooves and body look fine. Back in her heyday, she was actually a champion, and won this big rosette here. So let's bring her back to her former glory, where she could actually go and show again in the Briar OF division. First, I'm going to start by creating a paintable surface on the ear. I'm not using any primer, because obviously I don't want to actually ruin her finish, but I am going to be using sealant. Tester's dull coat to be specific. This is going to allow the pastels to hang on to something, and create an invisible primed layer. I'm going to be using my Korean Mungyo pastels for this repair. They're really pigmented, and I love using them for doll face-ups. You can also use pen pastels, earth pigments, or any other type of hard pastels. My goal is to restore her ear and not enhance it in any way. The judge should not be able to tell that there was a rub in the first place. If I'm successful, she'll be able to walk into that ring no problem and no one will know the difference. Therefore, I do my best to color match her ear already. I just dust on some pastels and make them as pigmented as possible, making sure there's not excess dust. Then I take her back out for another spray in dull coat. This happens a few times to build up the layers. There we go, all repaired. You can't even tell the difference. The only difference is that the repaired ear is matter than the original briar ear. Unfortunately, I'm out of gloss, so I won't be able to fix that part, but otherwise, it's a perfect match. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, please like and subscribe. You can follow me on Instagram at SelectArcane or on Facebook by the same name. Thanks for watching. Bye!